Well, and that's now that you know again, like we mentioned, that's one of the things that you now being on the coaching end, you work with some players that are seniors and you have kids that might be in that same position as you are. And you know by interacting with them, he's ready, he's not ready. Yeah. And, and it's hard because that is why some kids have an easier time going through maybe a junior college or going through a four-year university. The, the process is a little slower as far as growing up and which then is having good. to, which some kids need. Yeah, I, and yeah. I agree with that. And I, and I didn't understand what that meant. Mm -hmm. uh, people had told me that, like, you know what, like, you should go to college. You should, uh, you know, don't sign, don't go play with for the Reds, go to college, enjoy that, see what ends up happening after that. And I understood what they were saying, but I didn't understand what they were saying. And now that I'm done playing, I finally understand what some of these people were, we were saying. And thank God personally, like my parents, you know, they raised me on a good work ethic. So it, for any kid that's not necessarily, you know, you know, works their butt off, off the field and on the field. Oh my God. I couldn't imagine trying to just jump into this full speed, you know, and being able to just, just simple things, doing your laundry, yeah. you know, feeding yourself. Like yeah. so many kids are so pampered at home that like when they get away and they realize like, Oh God, like mommy and daddy is not gonna be able to do this for me. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, you're gonna have to figure that out on your own. Yeah. 